COVID-19 pandemic continues to have an impact on cities like, for example, Port Aransas, which thrives on travelers who visit their beaches and shops, but not so much these days. Chris 6 Sunrise reporter Jeremiah Marshall is there this morning. And Jeremiah, uh, I understand you actually met someone who was told they had to leave even though they have property there. Yeah, right, Mike. So just imagine you have a second home, right? And that it's here. You would think that I could be able to go to my home whenever I feel like it, but that's definitely not the case as this pandemic continues. And that's one way how this Austin man found out. Take a look. Because I did make a phone call to our HOA president there in the neighborhood, uh, made a phone call to the property management firm, made a phone call to our security folks there. No one was aware of this rule either. Guy Grice says he and his family wanted to get away from Austin for a while, so they drove to their second home in Port A. However, Grice says they were told by police and code enforcement since this was not his primary residence, he had to leave. But I, I, I haven't seen anything within the stay at home laws that say you can't travel from a primary residence to a secondary residence. So we spoke to Puerto Rico's Mayor Charles Bouillon for some clarification. I guess I'm, I'm amazed, Jeremy, why people don't understand what the governor said. Mayor Bouillon says the city is following strict orders along with additional restrictions set under mayoral order number four. Occupants must produce the original copies of any document or documents which prove the legitimacy of the occupancy. The governor says there's no travel except for essential business. A second home is not essential business. Visitors like Grice weren't too happy to hear about this. Uh, making up the rules as you go. It's not, it's not part of the game, right? Um, we have one person that, that mandates those rules and we have one person that puts addendums to those rules. Not every county, not every city. I mean, it's one governor, right? Mayor Bouillon says he understands this is a frustrating time, but taking care of everyone's health is the number one priority right now. We have a small population and we don't need that population to be infected by people bringing it from outside. 